Hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. First of all, read the question. This is the question. Which of the following muscle is penetrated by the parotid duct? So it is direct question that the muscle which is penetrated by the parotid duct. So here the options options are medial trichoid, buccinator, levator, angulae oris, temporalis, and masseter muscle. So first of all, let's see the parotid duct. The duct arises from the parotid gland and it opens in the vestibule of the mouth. So here we can see this is the parotid gland, which is one of the three pairs of the salivary gland, and this parotid gland it represents a duct which is the parotid duct and we can see here that the parotid duct it overlies the masseter muscle this muscle is the masseter muscle and anterior border of the masseter muscle it enters in um, the second muscle which is the buccinator and here we can see this buccinator muscle is pierced by this parotid duct and it turns into the vestibule of the mouth and this picture it is very obvious that we can see this gland this gland this is the parotid gland and here this is the sub mandibular gland and sublingual gland they are the major salivary gland around the oral cavity so from the parotid duct we can see it from the parotid gland there is a duct which is the parotid duct and this parotid duct it goes to the anterior aspect of the masseter and then it finally it pierces this muscle which is the vaccinator muscle and then it opens in the mouth in the vestibule of the mouth opposite the second molar tooth and in the third picture also here we can see this is very clear picture that this duct is the parotid duct and this parotid duct it overlies this muscle which is the masseter muscle and this is the buccinator muscle finally it pierces this point of the buccinator muscle and open into the mouth and here we can see it penetrates the buccinator muscle opposite the crown of the second upper molar tooth so this is all about the parotid duct and here we can see the parotid duct it is penetrated the buccinator muscle not other muscles such as medial trigoid levator angularis temporalis and masseter they are not pierced by the parotid duct it overlies the parotid uh, temporalis muscle but not pierce the temporalis muscle this point is very very important that the parotid duct it overlies the temporalis muscle that means it lies uh, over the temporalis muscle and also crosses the anterior border of the temporalis but not pierce the temporalis muscle it pierces the vaccinator muscle thank you all